Say goodbye, Caroline Rose. Well, I remember in my hometown, I met a pretty girl there. Well, I remember in my hometown when I met a pretty girl there. So, I'm just talking through my tactics for this session. I'm fishing with the loops and booms straight at the back of the wide gate, size 4 setup. I'm fishing with a 16mm bottom bait topped with a 12mm pop up. Fishing with mainline baits, doing about 8 to 12 baits per rod, dropping in pockets of grass, and I've managed to land 6 fish already. You don't need to buy 10 20 kilos of this bait to achieve great results. Kilo per session will definitely get you the results that you do need. So for this session, I'm fishing with the loops and booms. I'm using the size 4 wide gape X hook and the 7.5 inch boom section. The reason why I'm using these hooks for the session is they slightly thicker gauge. So it does allow me to apply that much more pressure to turn the fish away from them snags. I'm fishing quite close to them so you know try my absolute best to get them away. So far it's been 10 out of 10 you know I've landed every single fish right up against those snags. I've gotten them to turn away safely and it gives me a solid hook hold. This is definitely the way to go when fishing against these snags. Uh, it'll just give you that much more of a chance to land the fish. So I'm currently fishing the Longbow X45 rods, they come in a 3.75 test curve, 12 foot and these things are absolutely amazing. The rods have such a great backbone with a forgiving tip, I'm fishing tied up against some snags, I'm able to turn the fish properly without giving you hook pulls or anything like that and my fishing does require long distance range fishing. I do fish up to 6 7 meters sometimes, you need a decent rod, you can hit straight into that fish. So yeah, it's definitely, this is my, my go to rod at the moment. Um, coupled that to the Daiwa Emblem 35 reels, I've loaded 750 meters of J-Braid in 30 pound and on top of that I just splice a 45 pound Eurocord leader from quarter. Um, I do 10 meters of it to high abrasion if I'm fishing near snags or rocks or anything like that. I'm just not going to snap off or burn off. This is my setup that I'm currently fishing and so far it's been absolutely amazing. So goodbye.